Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and on this video I have another blind mailbag uh, I, I, on the last video it was a uh, the soldering iron the moss soldering gun uh, and about 20 minutes later the postman arrived with this so my assistant she got it and she, she actually opened it. I haven't seen what's in it. She, I just told her to put it down there because I want to do a blind mailbag on it. And here is my blind mailbag. So I thought I'll knock this one off and get this one out the road because uh, I was going to do a, a thing on it. I, I suspect I know what it is. I haven't actually seen it myself, but just my assistant, the wife that is. <laughs> uh, I have uh, I have an idea what it is. And I think it was, but anyway... Without further ado, I shall pull it out and we'll see what it is. Did, should I do with the drum roll? Drum roll, everybody. And here we go. Here comes, here comes it is. And what is it? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I know what that is. This is a bargain, uh, to be honest, if it works works right and everything. I bought it because uh, I'm, I'm planning to do some of these videos, uh, 360 videos. Uh, and I'm looking at getting the equipment together to, re to do it and this is a good start I think now on this it's called I'll just turn it over this one is called uh, it's unbranded most of the stuff is I get is unbranded but anyway here's what it's got it has it it's a 360 experience video it does 360 uh, I haven't opened it yet. I don't know what it looks like inside and there we are it's it does everything there look it's Wi-Fi uh, it says full HD. It's supposed to be 4K, uh, but at 244, uh, 60 megapixel photographs and a full 360 degrees uh, angle on it. And there's some of the shots you can take with them. If anyone isn't, you know, clued up or isn't really up on their 360s, that's what it does. And there's, there's what a 360 camera can do for you, uh, some of the little picks there and I'll just turn the box around so you can see there they, effective there's the streets normal and then in 360 and you know you can you can do different things with it and there's its spec it has uh, the type is a it's an 8 8.0 M uh, CMOS uh, I'm just trying to keep this uh, to focus and if you angle, it's an LCD model of size, it's not 0.96 LCD, which, you know, you look at them when you've got a camera stuck on your head, because you have to put this on your head, because if you don't, it'll block out, I'll be blocking most of the stuff out. I may just do it that way anyway, try it. And it's USB, uh, and it's HD out, and, it's, you can, and it has a, a micro USB slot, takes up to 128 gigabyte. Uh, it's built-in microphone, and file format is uh, movie h two six fours. And the photo is a JPEG. It's, it's resolution. There, look. And 1072 by 1072, 60 frames to 30 frames, frames a second. 1440 by 1440, 60 frames. And also 30 frames. That's on the 1080p. Put the 1080p on there. So, yes, it's supposed to be uh, maximum, oh, sorry, uh, maximum 64 gigabyte uh, card. Yeah, the micro SD card is 64 gigabyte. Photo resolution is uh, 16, 12, 8, and 5 megapixel. And there's the two apps if you go using for Android and for uh, Wi Fi. Uh, I think I'm, I might be using it for Wi Fi. I'm not sure, I'll just go and do that. And it was obviously made in China. And he's the, you know, round, square, inner, run, inner rim, half round, 360 panoramic, annular half and half and virtual reality i will be doing some vr stuff because i have a an oculus which i haven't done yet uh let's see i'll get this open i'm just going to open this and let let you see i'm not actually gonna you won't be seeing uh, what it's like because i will do that on another video the same as uh my last video but here's what i get uh here's the 360 camera that's a pan view there on the front and then you have the camera on top Here's the lens on top. Uh, that's the one that does the actual 360. It's uh, it's already fixed onto uh, 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 to put on a helmet or or your head a strap on your head, so it clips on so you walk around with you on your bonds. It's in a protective case already. 
Uh, and I, I, to be honest, it, it looks, it feels really well made, to be honest, uh, so far. Uh, i just take it out of its protective case. Uh, this is uh, a waterproof, by the way. It goes down, it's supposed to go down to 300 metres. And here's the actual camera itself. Uh, oh, yeah, it's got a lens protector on there at the moment. And it's just a simple on-up button. Uh, and there's your play uh, and Wi-Fi and all that. I haven't got into the instructions yet, as you can see. I've just opened it. And uh, I assume that's the speaker and the, the microphone. But, yes, uh, it looks like a good little uh, camera. And uh, the price I paid, £19. You know, I mean... I don't go in for real expensive stuff. I like to say I like the, you know, if I, I if when you when you're paying for uh, branded stuff, you know, like, uh, uh, sorry, um, like Samsung, Panasonic, and stuff like that, you're paying for the brand name. That's all you're paying for. Uh, to be honest, a lot of them use the internal works. I give you an example, like Digi Home t uh, Electronic stuff, uh, Digi Home TVs, a Digi Home TV could be Hitachi, Sony. All the top makes, all the top brands, and the, the what they do is, the 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 company is the, the company's in Portugal actually on Digihome, the the factory, and what they do is they make these TVs, what they make the frames up, and then they buy all the components from them companies, and they're licensed under them companies to use their their software. So when you buy a Digihome, you 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 don't know what it is. I have a list on the store brand, and if you get from the Co-op or Asda or places like that, it will have uh, I've got a list of what is sent to them. You know, because the, the the companies ask specifically for the brands. So if you like, if you go to Asda, uh, you will get a Sony or an Atachi. Simple as, and that's all their components. So yeah, I don't go for the brand. I'm not interested in branding. I'm interested in the product and if it works and if if, if it uh, suits my needs, if it's fit for purpose for me. Anyway, in here, yeah, uh, I have a plan to buy another camera. And all they're only cheap. But, you know, this stuff here is, you get full kits. This is a kit. And that's, uh, I, I don't know what that is. If anyone knows, tell me. I'm going to, I haven't read the instructions yet, but obviously, that, oh, I think that might be for the fisheye or it might be some type of thing that would go on top of the camera. Yeah, so the camera can, like, view from that side and that and there. Obviously, yeah. And it might, you know, view from there. It's got a small small dot thing there, I don't know what that is but uh, yeah, I was done that one cut a cloth to wipe the lens and a, a nice strap This there's two straps in there, two velcro ones they're, they're coming handy this is what will be probably used to stra strap around your chin and you have various things to put on your bike there look I mean, kits like this, if you were to buy a GoPro you pay for all this uh, and it's it's you get to get all this on the GoPro it's cost a bomb, and that's to actually connect there uh, onto one of them. And uh, let's see what else. We, I'll just take everything out. I've even got a USB lead. Uh, it's a, a Class C micro USB and uh, a, a normal USB is two two USB. Anyway, and then we got these plugs here. These here. They just connect it like you know various things so you can strap your camera up. And this uh, this protective case, this is you can drop it and everything. This actually, I've had these before, not the round ones on me on my uh, my uh, action camera, and they're quite strong. You know, they do get scraped, do get bashed, and all that because even that's got a lens cover on it there. But uh, they do protect the camera. Uh, and I'll just turn it around, make sure I've got everything on the right place. That's where the yeah, that's the on-off switch goes there. And I put the, you have to put the on this. You have to put the camera in first. So right, I used to just slot in there, but the camera slot in there. Get the switches down in the right place. Let's have a look. Uh, I will put that back together, but it's it's easy to do. It's just that I'm 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 re reaching round my, my camera stand. What am I going to do? Is see if there's any power in it. Uh, see what happens when I power it up. <sighs> No. Oh, there's the power button. Sorry. I understand the enough button. Yeah, obviously there's no power. It needs to be charged up first. Because uh, I'm not getting nothing there. So, yes, uh, a nice 360 camera. 
so i will be showing another video i'll let you see what the footage is like and what i think of it then but at present now uh, 19 quid you can't fall off if this if this is a brilliant camera for me i'll be happy with it uh, and you'll see the results because i will be putting the results on youtube anyway on that note uh please subscribe like share especially press that bell uh, and then you'll know because at present now I'm just random on when my videos are coming out because it's it, at present now I'm not too well because I've had uh, uh, I'm getting over a massive uh, chest infection and my respiratory tract is, is seizing up a bit so I'm now on massive amount of steroids and uh, antibiotics to clear it all up so as you, you uh, a lot of people from my last channel know my health issues uh, I do have a lot of health issues and sometimes it does affect with me affect me doing uh, videos so and even thinking properly and talking properly my memory is just totally short <laughs> i have to uh, it, i have to study i don't you, you'll notice in the videos that i might change to change the subject or i might not finish the sentence so, stuff like that happens to me uh but i do try and i do hope you understand that uh uh, it might, I might, sometimes I might not be understandable. Please ask me, shot it in there, tell me where I went wrong because sometimes I don't know. Uh, I have a, 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 a mental thing called uh, disassociation. So if you want to mm -hmm. Google disassociation, you'll see that DIY Grandad has that, but it it does affect me, it does get me down sometimes. But I, I want to fight through life and enjoy my grandchildren and show people some of the, my experience of what I've done through life. Anyway, on that note. Uh, I really do appreciate everyone coming to my site. Please come again. Uh, I will try and answer everybody. I do try. I do read everyone, uh, every comment, and uh, uh, you will get a reply from me. On that note, if it's not the reply, if it's not from me, it's from my assistant, the wife that is. <laughs> uh, I also have my son and daughter in law, and my, my daughters and sons helping me uh, do the comments. So they, they, they talk to me and ask me, and I tell them, what, you know, what to say back. So I, I do know a lot about people that's on my side. Anyway, on my channel, sorry. Uh, a great big thank you to everyone. Bye.